G'day everyone, how you all going? Welcome back to day 33, looking at my bees. Now, it's a little bit wet. We did get 0.5 millimeters of rain at the front, 0.6 millimeters of rain at the back. And the water is clean tasting now again. We put a filter onto it and it actually can taste it and it's actually got those, actually tasting it anymore. Let's have a look at the bees, shall we? I saw one bee there. Um, and it's sort of drizzling still, so that's one good thing. This one, oh, okay, we don't want to disturb our bees too much if we can. Um, yeah. I'm waiting for, I will get the trap, I'm waiting for the weather to get nicer so I can actually open them up. I won't open up in the daylight today because it's, we'll just do our usual checks. Um, all right, where I put this is going to be wet. <laughs> And you can't really put it back into there once you take this out. Okay, let's have a look at this. Um, I'll wait until it clears up. It's going to get hotter soon, so then I'll have a quick inspection of the top. So, so far, looks like it's only castings again, which is fantastic. I know, I'm sorry for disturbing you. I know you have a little big white thing. Um... I still taste a bit of the ash in the shower, but that will take a bit of time to clear up and let the things run for it. So I'll pause this video and we'll go have a look at the front in a minute. But it is a beautiful morning though. Have a look at this. Then you actually can't smell any smoke, thank God. Um, it's just a nice light drizzle of rain. I hope it's not too cold for the bees. All right, we'll be back. Welcome back everyone. Um, it's still nice and rainy. As I said before, you can actually smell the air and there's no smoke in it. Now let's have a quick look at the entrance. I don't think there's going to be much activity this morning because of the weather. Um, some force or one bee there. There's one bee there. Just poking the snows out the entrance there. Just duck back in. Uh, let's wait until the weather warms up for them. But I just before, I won't disturb. The beehive itself, I uh, won't disturb the top um, to do anything to any form of inspection until the weather's nicer. Can't do much about that. All I can do is just constantly a little look on the outside, make sure there's nothing coming in from the outside. And every day I'll check the, um, what do you call it? Every day I'll, oh, another couple of bees coming up. Every day I'll check the um, trap and make sure there's no pests in that getting in there. What I probably will do when I do do the inspection is make up a sugar water syrup, put it in that new container I've got to go on the top, double check the ideal, make sure the weather's getting it warm and not like this terrible like winter conditions we've got at the moment. Uh, make sure they are really nice and thick in the um, ideal uh, and then put the super on, then put the sugar syrup on top of that to encourage them to come up to there. Um, and also depends on how the weather's going to be, I hope, as well. Um, but if the weather's like this, um, smoky, rainy, not many flowers, and they haven't done too much to the ideal, I'm just going to put a sugar syrup on top of the ideal and um, leave it closed up and may not even put the um, super on this year. Um, my main concern is to keep these bees strong and healthy um, and see how we go from there. Um, that's my main concern. I wouldn't mind a bee from the, um, a, like a queen bee from that um, island that's been devastated by the fires. Because then, then if we could actually get some of those bees, we could keep the strain of that bee alive may never be able to go back to the um, island again but there may be a way you can do it if you could find a way to build a beehive or put a beehive in a controlled environment where you can control everything um, if I had the money to do that I probably would do that because that way there you can actually either build a controlled environment there or build it somewhere else get a couple of queen bees and re do keep that strain of bees going um, in a controlled environment so you, you can pretty much eliminate all pests um, and that way they, when they're ready to build up stock again there 
I could do that again. Well, I'm going to shoot off because I've got people messaging me too. At the moment, I'm just babbling anyway. Um, and I've got eggs on the boil too, so I better check those. Um, yeah, but as it's before, I'm happy with this weather. I don't think the bees are too happy with it. <laughs> but uh, at least we get some rain and no smoke for once. Oh, you all take it easy. Everyone have a great day.